get ready start due to unprecedented rains during september in hyderabad city several low lying areas were inundated hundreds of small houses were partly or completely damaged a number of people were either washed away or dead loss of property was reported heavy as secretary of the cooperative weaving society chirala you have collected rupees 1000 by way of contributions of one day's wages to the relief of the affected people draft a letter to the chief minister andhra pradesh enclosing a check for the amount requesting him to utilize the amount for the relief of the storm stricken poor people also intimate that you will be sending further contributions in due course question number 2 hundreds of school going little children have to go to the bus depot for renewal of their bus passes due to heavy rush they have to wait for hours in hot sun or in rain to avoid inconvenience to the children as secretary of the parents association of our colony draft letter to chairman andhra pradesh state road transport corporation requesting deputation of the concerned officer to the colony preferably on a holiday for the purpose of renewing bus passes also intimate that suitable place will be made available to the officer in one of the houses in the colony for the purpose question number 3 roads in your town are in a deplorable condition no steps are taken to repair the damaged ones the position is worse in lanes and by lanes roads are broken and left unfilled or off filled after giving drainage connections nobody seems to be worried of these ditches and they are a menace to one and all during rains they have become a source of danger to pedestrians and others especially in the nights as an affected person write to the concerned authority complaining about the same and remind that the municipality owes a duty to the taxpayer question number 4 you own two alsatian pups and intend to sell them they are of high pedigree and you expect rupees 150 each prepare a draft advertisement in the deccan chronicle for sale of the pups giving their age color and other particulars intending purchasers may personally see them at your house while enclosing the draft advertisement request the editor to publish the same for three consecutive days and inform you of the charges question number five there is an advertisement in the hindu by Messrs. singer merit and company king koti hyderabad from suitable candidates for the appointment as stenographers 40 words in english typing and 120 words in shorthand are essential graduates and persons with previous experience are preferred the posts carry a scale of 300 rupees to 500 rupees higher start will be considered in case of deserving persons with high qualifications and experience draft an application claiming higher start by virtue of your long experience and special qualifications at the inaugural function of the city civil court buildings the chief justice of india said i deem it a great privilege to have been invited this evening to declare open the city civil court building it gives me great pleasure not only to declare the building open but also to be in your midst for a short while as perhaps this is the last public speech i shall be making in this city i may say that my stay in this city had been a most exhilarating experience for me this new building which is a beautiful structure judging from the standards to which i am accustomed in regard to district courts will certainly fulfill the desires of the bench and the bar in the matter of accommodation but it must be said that the court buildings do not make administration of justice the best of the court buildings is just an ancillary to the administration of justice what is needed is a team of judges who will understand their responsibilities and go to the task of administration of justice in the right spirit administration of justice is a difficult task because most of the time the judge has to act objectively and there may be pressures there may be various other matters which may deflect him 
from that independence and that objectivity all that i can say is that no judge is worth his salt if he is not able to resist all these pressures and such other matters which should not enter into the making of a judicial decision judges must see to it that they work objectively and approach the problem in a spirit of justice and with equal facility to both sides they should not weigh the scale against one side or the other but should not hold it even so that both the litigants before the court the one who wins and who loses should feel that what the judge could do has been done and has been done without my fear or favor in this task there are many things which enter first the question of the cost of litigation which unfortunately in our country is abnormally high looking to the poverty of the people but that is a matter which is judges cannot help that is a matter for the government to consider because after all they prescribe the fees for litigation the cost of litigation is also for the lawyers to consider because they charge the fees for their services the courts can of course help indirectly by seeing what litigation does not prolong beyond a particular time every case if it is properly appraised beforehand should be made to finish within a stated time and a judge is a true judge who takes up the work not only with a view of doing but it senses at the very start how much of judicial time and court time that case deserves and gives that such time there is no need to hurry there is no need to hustle but at any rate you must be quite clear when you are approaching the case how much of judicial time it should really require and should not allow it to degenerate into prolonged litigation therefore justice which is quickly done will be the justice which will be the appreciated next is the question of the lawyers the lawyers must also realize that they are a part of the judicial system they are they are not only to present the case of their clients but they are there to assist the court to reach the just decision get ready start due to unprecedented rains during september in hyderabad city several low lying areas were inundated hundreds of small houses were partly or completely damaged